Good morning, everybody. It's August 14th, Saturday, and we're going to take a look at our garden this morning. Let's take a look from back here. We got a, our little jalapeno, and then we'll get up close here in a minute. But as you can see, now, you know, we've got a lot more green going on, and our bushes are starting to fill in. All our plants are getting bigger. So let's get a little closer. Now, on our jalapeno, we've got a whole bunch of these things started. Here's one. We got two, three, four, five. We got this big one. The sun's in my eyes. I'm having a hard time seeing. We got that nice big one right there. But we've got a whole bunch of them coming. There's an, another nice little one right there. So that's pretty cool. See we got our basils still there. Not doing a whole bunch. Spinach is doing nothing. Uh, we've heard that it's too hot for spinach for leafy vegetables yet. Should be a little cooler. Then we got this okra, which is actually doing pretty good. And then we got our peas, sugar, snap, and dwarf sugar. Those are doing pretty good. We got some tomato plants. Some of these are, uh, well, all these are the cheap ones that we got, and they're all doing good. They came around. We got us a sweet basil the other day, so we planted that. He's been kind of mopey. We think it's too much sun. We got, uh, these are the good tomato plants that I bought, and that one's got flowers on it already, so it won't be too long before that that one's the grape tomatoes that should be spitting out something pretty quick here so that's pretty cool we got that guy there's basically dead and this one's kind of weak this one here looks pretty good that one there looks weak that one looks okay just hasn't done much we don't really want them all to come in at the same time anyways we're hoping to get you know tomatoes for several weeks so if they all come in at different times hopefully our tomatoes will last longer we got cucumbers cucumber 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 a bunch of those coming up looks like something's been eaten on that one we got another cucumber it's got a flower on it I don't know maybe that'll start doing something then here are our beans and those look pretty good. The dog's been eating these. I don't know what... She comes over here and munches on the leaves so you can see some leaf damage and you can see the vines are really just taking off on these things. Gonna have to do something about that pretty quick. Then our watermelons, not doing a whole bunch. Pumpkins, looking pretty good. We got some peppers, a little pepper sprout there. That's about it though. And then oregano, I bought some oregano. And that's actually holding up. So that's it. And we're in this about 30 days. You know, it's not a, not a whole bunch of time. We don't have to weed it. The wife comes out and waters every night. You can see she watered last night. And uh, you can see the you know where we have seeds planted it's real dark all this area here there's nothing planted in in any of that and then it's it's real dark and it's not really a lot of water just this soil holds the water really good you can see there's nothing planted in these it's all real light so it holds water all night and it'll dry up here takes take close to the end of the day for it to dry up and then we'll water it again
But so far, seems like it's working pretty good. And that's it for this week. We'll see y'all next week.